The balance leash is one of our most popular tools in terms of being quick and easy to help your dog if maybe you have a dog that doesn't pull most of the time or if you have a dog that when you're going to the shelter that you need a quick and easy way to get them out of the run without being pulled off your feet or without pulling on the dog's neck. The balance leash is one of the most useful tools that we have. It can be used at shelters taking dogs in and out of their kennels. It can be used at the vet or at groomers. Just sitting at your vet or in dog training class if your dog is kind of spinning their wheels to want to get to another dog, this is a way that you can um, put a, just drop the leash around the middle of the chest and so that it's not choking them on the collar. So the easiest way to do this, if your dog's not pulling, basically all you want to do is take the middle of your leash and drop it around the chest and then you can take the pressure off the collar. Yes. You might also have a dog that most of the time is absolutely fine to walk on a leash on a collar, walks on a nice loose leash but maybe they see a cat or a dog or a squirrel or something and you don't want to be pulled off your feet. So this can be a great tool to help avoid that. Ollie, let's go for a little walk. This way, good boy. So if he gets a little bit ahead of me, which of course he'll walk perfectly now, what I can do is simply take the leash, Hold him by the collar for a moment, drop it around the chest without leaning over him. Now I can take the pressure off the collar and if I like I can just hold this in one hand. So when I give him a little signal, it's actually going to shift his balance back rather than be putting him out of balance and triggering a postural type tension through his back. What a good dog. Yes. That's a good boy. That's fine steady. Excellent. What a good boy. So sometimes you might have a dog that either is so used to pulling that they might either back out of it or jump over it. Or say you have a really small dog and what happens with the balance leash it just kind of comes up underneath their chin. So we can do what we call a balance leash plus. So to do the balance leash plus I'm basically going to drop the lead down and if I know my dog well, I can just bring the end up through the front legs so that it start, goes around the opposite side elbow from where you're standing. And to avoid this dropping off, I'm going to take the end, steady the, hold the leash in place, and bring this up through his collar. Good boy, Ollie. So this acts a little bit like sort of like a miniature harness if you will and the there's a little tiny signal up in between the front legs but of course my aim is to just be able to walk along on a loose leash good boy let's go Good boy. What a good dog. Let's go. That's okay. What a good dog. Steady. That's fine. 